again. So, I'll try and speak louder and more clear in this one because I know the last one were crap compared so speaking. Well, as you might have noticed in the last ones, I put in the description the reason why I'm chewing gum. Hide smoke smells. Yeah, I am a what you call smoker. I hate using that phrase for myself. I hate being a smoker. I like to call myself an, an occasional smoker because I have about two bags a day in the week and one maybe one at the weekend and sometimes I can go without one and I try to and it's my way of trying to cut back. Uh, I started smoking when I was with my first boyfriend which were about over oh, three years ago now. It's been a three years since split up in that like June -ish time. Anyway, yeah, been kind of started off having the bits of cigarette off him, bits of cigarettes off of people. Then I went to the shop with my best friend because um, he he smoked before, and then um, I smoked. He I smoked. He started with me again. He started started up and he bought the cigarettes because he was the age to buy them. I weren't even old enough to buy cigarettes in the UK, which legal UK age is 16. It's going up to 18 soon. It was like getting schoolgirls going into the shop, buying the first packet of cigarettes because it was so, so naughty and all this lot. And um, yeah, and I had one. I even failed to light it. I couldn't even get a grip on it. Um, I ended up wasting one on the floor because I'd got so much crap on it that it, that end where it didn't thingy anymore and anyway it's to the point right so yeah I started then so yeah I quit when um, I broke up with my first boyfriend which gave the code name of Sam the last in one of my videos in randomness one at randomness once was the first recording and I ended up starting up again because well, I did it at my old job. I, I kind of had two buses to get there, and I used to smoke in between buses, and um, people smoked while I used to be in the office with. Um, so there used to be quite a few people going out and smoking, and well, I pretty pretty much started again when I like went up to my best friend's house. I kind of smoked with him and um, his sister and her boyfriend because we're all like it's all like a social thing and every time I did smoke every time I did smoke to start off with it was like a social occasion and then as I said when I moved up to I think it was mo I moved from if people know Sheffield I moved from one place for my work which was going aside to another which were Seven Fields and when I got to Seven Fields I started smoking outside with people when they were going outside I used to have one odd one week catch a bus and stuff like that and it soon got to be a, a continuous thing where I would do it most days and grow, grew, grew more and more and I, I tried quitting again when I got my new job uh, but then I ended up going out with someone who was smoking again and, which were, he was my third boyfriend. My second one um, well, gave the nickname of Ian but second proper boyfriend he, I went out with him before for like two days and then when we had tried to make it into a proper relationship um, he actually asked me to quit smoking and at the time it was like I only have one every five months I'm not going to quit for you because I weren't that serious about him and it seemed like a big thing to quit for him and yeah I sound like a stupid girl anyway um, so I started smoking more again when I got my third bite with my third boyfriend I went out with him for two months and I was smoking more when I was around him and it kind of led on still when I, I finished with him I still smoked quite a bit because my best friend still smoked. Every few months I quit for a while I weren't going up to my friends because I sleep around there a lot and when I go up for the weekend and sleep I'm pretty bad. I have many, many, many cigarettes I can smoke like a packet in a day which is pretty bad like a pack of 20 or a pack of 10 
well, normally 20 lasts me like a day and a half when I'm up there, which is pretty bad. But then I've got to cutting down more and more, and then um, at New Year's, this started just New Year's, I said, that's it, quitting. Finishing with more, quitting them. And then I got a boyfriend again who smokes because I broke up with me have a boyfriend and got with him and he smoked and he ended up starting to smoke again with him and it's carried on from there and I've been smoking beginning of this year again and been getting quite bad alright and then I said well every smoker says this I'm gonna quit that's it finished took gold turkey or gonna get those nicotine patches and quit so I said when I when I broke up with him I made like a pact to well, I said to my sister, I'll quit by I'll go to Cyprus because she doesn't smoke and my best friend smokes and she didn't want to be around true smokers. So I said, I quit. And I ended up saying then in the end, I said, well, Cyprus is going to be my last big bit and then I'm going to quit after Cyprus. And then I've been I'm really down level in Cyprus where we're having like a pack a day and it was terrible and it was horrible. And then I got back to UK and started because... I can't smoke in my house, my parents don't smoke, my brother hates it, my dad hates it because my granddad died of it and that's a pretty bad thing. But they do know I do it but they don't want to recognise it. They all know because I did smoke in front of them when I got to my granddad's funeral last year because I, 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 was, I was stressed and I was a bit upset so I ended up digging for my next thing after alcohol. I know I have both at the same time because it were an upsetting time for me. Um, yeah, and that's, and then it came back to my side, still doing it. Keep saying I'm going to finish the pack now and quit. Well, to get to the end of this long thing, I am going to say that now, I'm quitting. Starting now, I had my last cigarette from my packet, from when I did my last video about moving on up, moving on out. I had my last cigarette from that, and I've decided after that, I'm going to make a clean fresh start tomorrow and I'm going to quit. Tomorrow I am catching the bus to work, two buses up to work because my dad's not at work and I'm going to catch a lift with him because we're both working kind of the same place. In, well, in the same place but not in the same office. And So I decided that the best time to stop was when I'm catching two buses when I would normally smoke more and then one of my most stressful days at work cause but well, I've got a colleague to help me out with, with stuff in the beginning of the week and end of the week I'm doing all the main bits, what she does at the beginning of the week, which is the most stressful part of the job. So I will be quitting and recording this because now I've stayed on here, I can't really go back on it. Hopefully I won't. Um, yeah. No more fag and I hope I can stick to it this time. Yeah, and it started being professional start and all that. Should be one of the things, yeah. I did the video about dyeing my hair. As you can see at the top, I think you can see the natural colour. Not sure if you can see it properly. It's like a dark blondish, but it's been bleached a bit back, so into a blonde. Anyway, I'm going to go now. She looks in her bag, takes out a fag, tries to get away from the guy on the black, can't find the light. Yeah, use my 